I was thinking about getting a dog. Yeah? Either a Labradoodle or a Chinese Mountain b- Burrow dog. I've never... I've never heard of a Chinese what mountain burrow dog. What is a Chinese dog. mountain burrow What are those? Dog? I think I combined a couple of dogs. I think oh, you, you mean did. a Bernese mountain dog? Yes. yes. <laughs> Bernese. Oh, okay. Bernese yeah. python. Wait, what is the thing called? A Bernese mountain dog. My, my, uh, yes. My, I think they're really cute. Yeah, they're really cute. My sister has a Newfoundland. They're about the same size. A Newfoundland? Yeah. Wait, are you fucking with me? Newfoundland, yeah. Oh, from the actual country? Uh, yeah. I mean, I suppose that's where they originated. Wow. I don't know, but Newfies, they call them. I have a Slovak wiener. I'm not referring to my dog. <laughs> you won't get a dog. Can you please put that in your bio? He does have a Slovak. Dude, I have a theory that Slovaks have huge cocks, dude. My dad's coming by. Why don't you ask him? <laughs> Should I? Should I? No. <laughs> no, not? it's too weird, bro. Dude, imagine your dad shows me his cock. No, that's actually pretty funny if we have him on the <laughs> podcast and Jonah goes, okay, so we don't want, like we don't talk about anything like family related, related to me. It's just about my dad's penis. <laughs> All right, that's kind of funny. Go ahead, Jonah. What do you want to know? David says you have something to ask me. I'm like, okay, Mr. Dobrik. Yeah, let's see what he'd actually say. How big is your cock? Oh, oh Jonah, at the... Uh... That it's a good size, you know, normal. Why, why do you ask? No, that's not what he'd do. That's what he do. He'd get really awkward, I think. Jonah has to ask him. No, ask him in private. Jonah, if my dad was here and you had to work in asking how big his penis is, how would you do it? It'd be really funny if it was like super nonchalant, like we're all having pizza or whatever. And then I'm like, oh, can you pass me the pepperoni? How big's your cock? And then like... <laughs> <laughs> like, it was like, su- like, just, like out of the blue. Excuse me? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, no, pass me the wrench. No, but what you say before that? About the how blue cheese? You, how big is your cock? <laughs> blue cheese. That's what I thought you said. <laughs> how big is your cock? Can I have the wings? <laughs> All right, guys, my parents are going to be here any second. I'm going to have my dad on the podcast, and I'm going to have Jonah ask him <laughs> the question. Oh, my God, that's going to be really, really fun. Okay, next thing you're going to hear is my dad. You're, he's going to ask how big his cock is? Yeah. yeah. That's oh my weird. God, bro. Like, if it gets really weird, can one of you guys save me so your dad doesn't hate me forever? Bro, I just imagine Jonah doing it, and all three of us going, Whoa! <laughs> Yo, Dumas, Dumas. What the fuck, Jonah? That's David's dad! <laughs> <laughs> like, that's how I imagine it. My dad's here. Okay, Jonah, what would you want you to ask him? Look, him? look him in the fucking look, eyes. Man. I don't know how to look him in the eyes and ask him, How big is your penis? <laughs> Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> we, we just want to get your initial reaction. We don't. We don't want an answer. Oh, wait, wait. I'm so sorry for that. You I'm so sorry. Answer it, but how do you? Oh my react god! To your that? son got in my brain. I'm sorry. He's been doing this for four years. John, how do you feel? I'm so nervous. I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> I can't even look at your dad. He's sitting like two feet away from me. <laughs> Before you came in, there was this big long wind up that when you got in here, somehow Jonah was gonna ask you how big your penis was. We were gonna like initially it was gonna be like, oh, can you pass me the pizza? How big is your penis? <laughs> oh, can you pass me the wings? How big is your penis? <laughs> like until you like caught on and like you're like, wait, what the fuck? He's asking me how big my penis is. Uh dude, they we shouldn't have these conversations with parents. Funny stuff, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I have an idea. It's going to sound a little weird, but listen, swimwear for otters, right? Because you know why? Because most of the, most of the animals in the animal kingdom are either majority of the time in the water or on land, but otters are one of the only animals that likes to spend a little time on both. Sure. So I feel like it'd be nice to differ, like for the otter community, I think it'd be easier to differentiate when an otter's about to go into the lake or the ocean or whatever, (laughs) because he'll have his bikini on. (laughs) So I think, I think there'll be less miscommunication. Yeah. Yeah. When the otter's like, yeah, so where are you going? Well, <laughs> I got my swim trunks on, so where do you think I'm going? I'm going to the Because, you know, because they, they do, I don't know. What do you think? I think it's a... How much, what percentage of the company do you want and for how much can you offer me? <laughs> this is quite literally the shark tank. <laughs> <laughs> but for otters. Um, okay. It do, does sound like a good gag on the shark tank. You don't want any part of it? I'm in. I like it. I think it's great. I think there's stuff, definitely something funny we can do with it. I'm so fucking high. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. Are you one of these guys that would want a sex robot? No, no, no. Not a sex robot. No, we were just talking bro. about that. Not a sex robot. A fucking, like a real robot. Like a friend. Like a, like a, ro- <laughs> like a robot. You've, that- a friend. 
No, no, no. We're your friends. I'm just into like robots and stuff. Like I can't wait for the future to like create fucking robots that like walk next to you and stuff. Why don't you just get a monkey? It'd be funny if you got a robot and then the robot started to fucking make fun of you all the time. <laughs> right, what? Like he gets the robot as a friend. I love how I'm doing the podcast with you and I'm like, wait, what did you just say? <laughs> You're still eating Doritos. Yeah, wait, what? I'd say it'd be funny if he got like a robot and it was his friend, but the robot just fucking made fun of him all the time. <laughs> yeah, the just started to hurt, hurt his feelings. The what? robot's name is David. <laughs> you ha- you fat fuck, you have to lose weight. <laughs> you fat fuck, you have to lose weight. <laughs> Ilya, can you get on that, Otter Swimmer? Yeah, I'll, ta- I'll talk to a couple people. <laughs> oh, you're pitching Ilya on Otter Swimmer now? <laughs> yeah. No, imagine, imagine four years from now, Ilya and I haven't spoken. And just all of a sudden, I see Otter Swimmer. And it's just fucking blowing up. And like and making millions of dollars. And I'm yeah. just like, are you fucking kidding me? In the Roadster. Otter Swimmer. Swimwear is a good name for swimwear. Yeah, it is pretty good. Really good. Is it like a, is it swimwear for otters? Yes. That's a fucking genius idea. Why do you think that? Okay, hold on a second. Why you go to you go to the beach and otters are always naked? That's good point. I didn't even think of nudity. <laughs> so you put like, then otters can be in movies that are PG thirteen because yeah, they'll be covered. Yeah, they'll be covered, and not only that, but like you don't want to see an otter. Well, how how would you know if the otter likes what they're wearing? What? Well, wait, Riffin Designs. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard anybody say. <laughs> There's one thing say. I learned watching the octopus teacher, that the animals are pretty happy as they are. We all look at Jonah. <laughs> I know, right? right? You guys all look at me like, I guess, yeah. <laughs> Jonah's, like, Jonah's, like, Jonah's like, I'm not an otter. <laughs> oh, we all looked at Jonah when we were talking about animals like Jonah. So like, like, like Jonah. Like Joan had a response for the animal community. Well, he like, kind of like came he on there. He represented all. He kind of came on there like the otters when he likes your idea. Yeah, you're right. You're right. I think it's a cool idea. Thanks, man. To put clothes on otters. Yo, we should make this a spinoff. Just talking about otters. Yeah. Like just us four dudes <laughs> just talking about it. What should it be called? What should it be called? Uh, the otters. Gu- the, the otter guys. <laughs> the otter guys. <laughs> the otter guys. <laughs> that's, oh, so good. That's, that's really good. good. No. You need to make really otter banks. Outer uh, banks with otters in sexy that, swimwear. Oh, that's, outer banks. that's the otter. That's the otter universe. We don't want to get into that, <laughs> dude. That's crazy. The otter guys. Guess what I found out this morning. Oh gosh, I'm, not, I'm nominated for a Kids Choice Award. <gasps> oh, <laughs> fun. <laughs> what are you nominated Good. for? Um, biggest, biggest loser. Dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> uh, favorite male social star. Yeah. Guys, go vote for me, please. Yeah, uh, David. David really needs this one. <laughs> Pick him back up. Go God get him damn it.